The United Auto Worker strike is one of several major strikes that we've seen over this past year. In my one on one interview with Ron DeSantis, I asked him how he'd handle the tensions around U.S. labor if he were president. It's an interview you'll only see on KCCI. If you were president, how would you work to support the American workforce, labor in America, without hurting the American economy? Well, first of all, I think with, with respect to um, the auto industry and the auto workers, uh, one of the things that's a big threat to that is Biden's uh, push to impose electric vehicle mandates. Uh, the reality is, is that's not where the market is. We want to preserve the ability of automakers to actually produce the type of vehicles that people want to buy. That will mean more auto worker jobs because the industry will do better, the companies will do better. So it's an example of government trying to force something on the private sector that's not going to be good for the companies and it is going to end up with fewer jobs in the industry. So we will come and we will save the day on that. You can watch more of my exclusive interview with Ron DeSantis online at KCCI.com and Sunday morning on KCCI 8 News Close Up at 1030. Scott.